Together, let us pray the second novena to Our Lady of Good Counsel. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Opening Prayer O Holy Virgin, to whose feet we are led by our anxious uncertainty in search for an attainment of what is true and good, invoking you by the sweet title of Mother of Good Counsel, we beseech you to come to our assistance when, along the road of this life, the darkness of error and of evil conspires towards our ruin by leading our minds and our hearts astray. O seat of wisdom and star of the sea, enlighten the doubtful and the erring, that they be not seduced by the false appearances of good. Render them steadfast in the face of the hostile and corrupting influences of passion and of sin. O Mother of Good Counsel, obtain for us from your Divine Son a great love of virtue, and in the hour of uncertainty and trial, the strength to embrace the way that leads to our salvation. If your hand sustains us, we shall walk unmolested along the path indicated to us by the life and words of Jesus, our Redeemer, and having followed freely and securely even in the midst of this world's strife, the Son of Truth and Justice, under your maternal star, we shall come to the enjoyment of full and eternal peace with you in the heaven of salvation. Amen. The Second Day Mary, our mother, you have always been concerned with the affairs of the world and of each person throughout history. You have provided counsel and comfort to those who needed you, even during your earthly life when you visited your cousin Elizabeth while she carried John the Baptist in her womb. Our Lady of Good Counsel, today I ask for your intercession for a world in need of your guidance and for counsel in my own life. Kindly state your intentions here. For guidance for our world leaders, pray for us. For counsel for those who are persecuted and suffer grave injustice, pray for us. For an increase in love, trust and devotion to your Immaculate Heart that leads us to Jesus, pray for us. Blessed Mary, Star of the Sea, guide us now as you have guided pilgrims in years past. Be our constant beacon, a blazing light in this dark night, and lead us home to dwell with your Son forever and ever. Amen. Novena to Our Lady of Good Counsel Mary, Virgin Immaculate, and my Mother, who art the Mother of Good Counsel and Mother All-Powerful, take me under your guidance, because, ignorant and blind as I am, I am scarcely able to discern the truly good from that which is evil on account of the seductions of the devil, my own passions, and the false maxims of the world which draw me from the ways of grace to the paths of perdition. Unless you direct me with the light of your heavenly wisdom, I shall not certainly be able to escape eternal misfortune. You, who had the privilege of being on earth, the counsellor of the apostles 
in the establishment of the church assist me also by your wise counsels to the end that i may faithfully discharge all the duties i owe my god and my neighbor i firmly promise to follow always your counsels and in my doubts to have recourse to you with confidence i also promise to cherish a tender devotion to you as mother of good counsel so that being guided by your assistance i hope after the grace of a good life and a happy death i may be permitted to share in the incomparable glory with which god has crowned you by praising blessing and rendering thanks to you for all eternity amen pray for us mother of good counsel that we may be made worthy of the promises of christ our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil amen hail mary full of grace the lord is with you blessed are you amongst women and blessed is the fruit of your womb jesus holy mary mother of god pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death amen concluding prayer most glorious virgin chosen by the eternal counsel to be the mother of the eternal word made flesh thou who art the treasurer of divine graces and the advocate of sinners i who am thy most unworthy servant have recourse to thee be thou pleased to be my guide and counselor in this vale of tears obtain for me through the most precious blood of thy divine son the forgiveness of my sins the salvation of my soul and the means necessary to obtain it in like manner obtain for holy church victory over her enemies and the spread of the kingdom of Jesus Christ upon the whole earth amen glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen